All right. So here we are at the Tul Tompung Market, otherwise known as the Russian Market. Why? Because the Russian hospital is nearby and this is where the Russians used to conduct all their import, import exports from. So that's why it's called the Russian Market and that's why the Russian hospital is also just around the corner. Now watch this, see? you've got to be so careful. Nobody bloody stops. Anyway, that's another story for later. Right, let's go and check out the market in a minute. First I want to see... What do I want, actually? Sure. I do know. Oh, this is where I get my shoes. They have very nice sneakers, which I got here. For $25. They're real. They're real, but they've fallen off the back of the lorry, if you know what I mean. They, these Adidas that normally in the US cost about 125 or something like that. Those long ones. You have short ones? Short, short here? Let's see. Okay. Let's come back. Where can I get a uh, bracelet? Over there? So I'm, I'm looking. They've got, they got shoes, they've got all kinds of clothing, which is great. I have to come back to buy some sports clothing later so I need some more shorts and tops but right now I'm looking for bracelets because I've I love my bracelets uh, the Cambodian bracelets the, the, the what's it called the uh, oh God, tiger tiger iron whatnot I think it's called anyway um, oh they got they got socks here too which I also need socks and underwear i will be coming back to look for that in a minute, too. Yeah, but the underwear is tricky. You need to have long, a long outlet like that, otherwise it crutches up into your, creeps up into your crotch. This is good. Hello. Oh, we got, we got some stuff here, see? Oh, I'll come back. I'm gonna come back here and get some stuff, there, need some stuff. This is all real stuff, by the way. It's, it's, it's not knockoff, it's just, uh, as I said, it's falling off the back of a lorry. So let's have a look if I can find the bracelet place. Here we're getting to the kind of a uh, touristy antique, not a, you know, sculpture stuff like this. Which is interesting. Interesting Buddha sculptures and whatnot. So yeah, Buddha's, um, what do you call it? Um, Buddhism sculptures and stuff like that. So let's see if we can find the bracelets. Feels like I'm getting close, but I still can't see them. But very nice, isn't it? They've got all kinds of herbs and oils and stuff here. Where are the bracelets? The bracelets, the bracelets, the bracelets. There are some, but they're not my cup of tea. They're over here. All right, let's have a look. Let's see what we got. Hello. The lady is stringing my tailor-made um, a tiger eye bracelet for me, so it fits me. Yes. Thank you. Yes. What's your name? Sreon. Sreon. Sreon, nice to meet you. I'm Rob. Yeah. You Rob? Okay. Look at this nice thing. Nice to meet you. Thank you. This is a what? A cobra? Whiskey. Cobra. It's a cobra, dead cobra mm -hmm. snake in here. It's a, it's a whiskey, apparently. Look at that. Holy mm -hmm. crap. No, I would. Did they eat the cobra? Yeah, they eat the cobra. They eat the cobra. Is there, something, is there a snake in there too? And something else? What's this? Yeah. What's that? Cobra Jensen. Oh my god. You know Jensen? Jensen, yeah. yeah. This is very, very bizarre, huh? Well, it's Cambodia for you. Yeah. Cambodia, Cambodia, Cambodia. Very interesting indeed. It's wonderful souvenirs and items here, but uh, yeah, I don't really buy any of them because I move around too much and I would break them and I'd break all this stuff, you know, and I don't leave it behind or whatever. I travel very, very lightly, uh, so I'm just flexible, you know. I live with like one, one uh, duffel bag and a, and a backpack and a, and a, and a computer bag. And that's about it. That's all that I, that's all that I need to to get around the world. I keep my, I travel very light, and I just wash my clothes because that's all you really need. 
Keep it simple, be humble, and get rid of all the junk. Okay, let's go and see. All right. So you want to put it on for me? Yeah. Look like this one or too loose? Let me see. No, it's good. Okay, okay, okay. Let me try. Okay. <laughs> you should give me six dollars. Five. <laughs> Darling, I told you in Simrip, it's like three. Right, so I got my, finally got my tiger eye bracelet, which I love. Goes well with my um, dragon metal pen. So there's some people behind me, so I better get out of the way. Yeah, she said there's not many people here. Phnom Penh is very quiet. I mean, it seems quite, it seems more busy to me. But and again, it's a city I'm used to being in, Kampot, which is a village, which is busy but quietish. You know, it's definitely quiet there too because people are complaining. I see the restaurants are half empty or more or less empty all the time actually at the moment. It's very, very low season. But the problem is Cambodia is still suffering from the uh, COVID rubbish. No, thank you. And that's a big, big problem because Cambodia always comes after Thailand and uh, uh, it, Vietnam and Bali and it's, they're still struggling. So that's just a shame because Cambodia is a beautiful place to be. Anyway, more on that later. <laughs> All right, so. Quite hard to find what I want. I don't like those boxer shorts, they're too short. Because they ride up your crotch, you know? I'm not really, not really in a shopping mood anyway. But we'll have a little look, see what we got. How much are these? Six. Six. Yeah. Not too bad, but I don't like the colour or the style. Uh, this one? Ten dollars. Ten? Oh, okay. Anyway, see? You really got to take some time to find what you want. Thank you very much. I'll be back. It's not easy. It's not easy. You've got tons and tons of stuff, but you've got to spend like a couple of hours roaming around. Look, the problem with the boxer shorts is always the same. They're too short. This is not good. This, this goes straight up your crotch. All of this. You've got to have longer ones. That's why I tend to not wear them anymore. I just go with It's easier that way. Anyway, that being said, New York, I want a Cambodia t-shirt. You have a Cambodia t-shirt? Huh? Cambodia? What? You have one? Let's see. No, that one is not, that's, that's not my color. That's for, that's for girl. She doesn't have, unfortunately. Banana Republic, knock off. Yeah. Okay. Didn't, I want to have one of those Cambodia things, you know? Anyway, so look, that's it. Hard. I want to get one of those Cambodia t-shirts, or I love Cambodia. So I cannot find. Anyway, now we're walking out the other side of the, the Russian market, uh, market, Russian market, market, where they sell all kinds of food. Now, it's a little bit early. It's only like quarter to two. Later on, it's, it's full, fully loaded with uh, all kinds of meat, fish, seafood, and um, it's basically a wet market. But they, those vendors don't seem to be here yet. They come around, I think, four or five. We've got fruit, we've got eggs, we've got all kinds of vegetables. And here we have seafood. And we're just preparing it. So look, the big shrimp, yeah? This guy's bringing the shrimp, showing the water. That's that. So yeah, they're just getting the place set up. So the sales for the food tend to happen later on in the evening. I think uh, between 4 and 8 p.m., something like that. Yeah, it's a shame. Uh, so I'm here a bit too early. Anyway, that being said, that's my little round trip of the Tungbong area, a.k.a. Russian Market. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed the show and I hope to see you soon in my next video. Alrighty. Hello man, how you doing? Uh, the Cambodian people are so friendly, it's amazing. And I love it.
Except for the honking, I don't like too much. Anyway, see you later, alligator. Alrighty, now we're back in the tuk tuk. Heading, heading back to my guest house and to the bank. Yeah, you're gonna go see my bank, ABA is called. <laughs> so, yeah, you can see it's, it's um, Saturday afternoon, early afternoon. It's quite, it's not very busy. S liquor store there, you get all the booze in the world you want for very cheap prices. That's the good thing about Cambodia, too. Alcohol is very cheap. I like wine. Yeah, so, alrighty then, guys, that is that. Have a good day and don't forget to follow me, subscribe, like, and share this video, okay? I appreciate it very much if you do, because I'm here to promote health and also Cambodia and lifestyle and travel. See you soon. And another little glimpse from the tuk tuk. Uh, there's a pupu canal. Pupu canal, indeed. Alright, bye bye. Say goodbye, sir. Bye bye. Bye bye.